Hey guys, we will solve the lab password reset poisoning via middleware. The level of this lab is practitioner and the goal is to log in into Carlos account. We use our default credentials Wiener and the password Peter. Okay, let us access the lab. At first we click on the login page and here we click on the forgot password link. We put in our username, that's Wiener, and submit it. Okay. Now we go to the exploit server and here we will open the email client. You see, we received a new password reset mail uh, with the query parameter in the URL temp minus forget forgot minus password minus token. Click on the link and change the password. I use the same password Peter and Peter again and submit it to our application. Okay, now we will switch to burp and here we open the HTTP history tab and we look for a post request to the endpoint forgot minus password. This one and during a pen test or a bug bounty program, you can use the guess headers function to find headers which can be used to point the dynamically generated reset link to an arbitrary, arbitrary domain. Okay, we will send this request to burp repeater and open burp repeater and we will put in the HTTP header x for warded minus host double point and now we open the go to ex exploit server and here we will copy the address of the exploit server of course without slash and exploit copy and put it to this x forward minus host header okay paste it we will send a uh, uh, replace uh, username to carlos and we will send the request you see, we received an HTTP 200. Okay. Okay. Now we go to our access log and we will look for a get request to the endpoint slash forgot minus password from a different IP. This one looks nice. Uh, here's the query parameter temp minus forgot minus password minus token. And we will copy the token. Okay, copy and open a new browser window. Put in the new token and make some spaces. Switch back to the access log, and here we will go back to our exploit server. Open the email client and we will use the first URL from our first password reset copy and paste it and now we have to replace the old token with the new one okay so and hit enter we set the password Peter Peter again Right, now we will try to log in with, with Carlos and our new password Peter. Carlos and Peter log in and we solved the lab. 